Oh, ooh, this next gentleman, very, very talented, very, very talented. They all talk about this guy. So this is my first time seeing him, but I've heard nothing but good things about him. Why don't you welcome Mr. Steve Utterkirk, ladies and gentlemen. Ho! Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, thanks. Thank you very much. It's a pleasure to be here at the Golden Sales tonight. Uh, I was just, I want to bring this up right away. I was just, um, I just got cable TV and I was watching, they have a lot of reruns, I was watching the Dick Van Dyke show and I can't get this off my mind. Isn't that a horrible name? If you had to pick one, Dick Van Dyke. <laughs> you know about the worst? And I found out, I asked around, I found out that is his stage name. His real name is Penis Van Lesbian. And he had it cut down to Dick Van Dyke for career reasons. I think it was a good move, to be quite honest. It's been a weird day for me all around, I'll be honest. Um, it's been, I tell you. It's been different the whole day. Um, I'll be honest with you folks, uh, one of these arms is fake. You guys can be the judges. Is it this arm? Or is it this one? Take your time. Any guesses? Any guesses at all? Now notice when I came in, there's a lot of guys in here tonight. Now they have, you get a lot of guys in here. The, the places to meet women now are the discos with the loud music and everything. So what you do is you get one of these, you go into these places and you do this. It works out great. That's true. Uh, I, I like to, um, it's a sick crowd, this should be fun. Um, I like to pass along a few tips if I can while I'm up here. This is for mostly for guys. On a first date, you go on a first date, you know a first date isn't going that well. If at any point throughout the evening she precedes any statement with, hey, look, <laughs> it's not going that good. You can pretty much drop her home right then, I think. A little juggling here now, folks. We have regular juggling, backwards juggling, one in the middle, two on the sides, fake juggling. <laughs> over there with the right hand, over there with the left hand, over the head with both hands. You people act like you see this shit every day. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh. I don't know, I don't know. Something much better. First time seen here in Long Beach, ventriloquist juggling. Yeah, hold, hold on your eyes, Karen. This is incredible, Karen. Karen, watch how realistic this looks. It's really staggering. I swear. Look. It looks like it's coming right at you. And you can ask Karen here. It's incredible. All right, now this. This is fun. If you guys are uh, into practical jokes at all, get a small tape recorder like this one. Go to any public place, slip into a blanket, and then just like turn it on. That's fun, but if you want to blow people out, do this. Hi. Okay. Say hello to the nice lady. Come on. Hello, nice lady. Good, good. <laughs> now play the trumpet. <laughs> good. Good. The best one, you know you go to church, baby's constantly crying in church. I like to take this thing and get a little revenge. I go into mass, wait till it's real quiet. You can do this.
Be best, best practical joke you can ever play, though, is if you're at a party, find a guy that's like really loaded, not a little bit. The guy's got to be pretty far gone, then walk up to him and go, Hey, man, you okay? <laughs> kind of freaks him out. Um, This is fun. Go into a 7-Eleven, any part of the day, and just go, yeah, excuse me, do you sell diapers here? Uh, I'm really going to need these badly, and if you could help me out at all, I think this would be a real good...